The attempt to redefine marriage is profoundly important because what it's actually saying is a structure that has persisted um, sanctioned by the religions since almost their first inception is to be erased in the name of a form of equality that doesn't even bring liberty. And actually why this is so important is the attempt to redefine marriage, though it sounds liberal, it sounds right on, is actually profoundly illiberal uh, and profoundly unconservative and it's bad for homo and heterosexuals alike because it creates a society in which the differences between us can't be endorsed, respected and enjoyed and actually creates a situation where the interests of gay people and the interests of straight people are opposed. And that doesn't further any good for any of us. And I think it's profoundly important that we face this head on because the attempt to rewrite the fundamental structures of our lives is part of what's most insidious and most damaging about modern culture, which is a type of new and dangerous totalitarianism that is seeking to reduce all of our democratic plurality and diversity to a kind of one um, terrifying model where actually none of us differ because they've made us all the same. I think people should attend this event because in a way it concerns one of the most profound uh, aspects of human life which is that of marriage uh, and it concerns some of the greatest threat to what is most profound and important to us and that's the rise of a new totalitarian form of liberalism that enforces equality on us no matter what our differences are.